In addition to writing your workout and collecting great data, you can also take notes for that workout and take attendance. If an athlete's absent, just toggle them off. If an athlete's going to be training with a different group that specific workout, you can change that here. On top of that, you can email, print, copy, delete, and move the workout into different folders. For emailing and printing, you have the option to include or exclude running metrics, notes, and attendance. If you include running metrics, you'll get the running distance and time shown on the right-hand side of the printout. If you exclude running metrics, you'll just get the PDF with the text itself. If you want to copy this workout for a future date or for a different team, just click copy. Here you can change the date, you can change the time, select a different team and the group you want it for. You can also copy the notes and set your default intensity. Here when you hit create, that same workout will get copied for the new date and for that new team. Make the modifications you need and you'll be done before you know it. Lastly, you can click on this pencil icon to edit the workout details. Here you can add or edit the name and all of the other options available to you when you first create a workout.